Hey guys, how you doing today? It's me, Kelly. So today we're going to do a fabric creations from plaid. This is just a piece of fabric I have. That is a, uh, a fabric mat that you put underneath to help with your printing. It comes in a package of two. There's the package. Um, these are fantastic because you place them underneath, obviously, what you're printing. And, um, you know, you have a nice printing station. I am so excited about this. I, I can't even tell you. So that color is hot pink. And I'm going to use the, uh, it's kind of like a, a lace Mandela in a sense stamp. And you'll see that. Um, I make a mistake on here as I'm going through, but I don't stop. I'm so excited. And I will definitely do, be doing another video um, on these, you know, with these stamps a little bit better prepared. I didn't expect um, to be so excited when I did it. So again, hot pink. Um, and I messed up the one feather, but that's okay. Um, I'm still gonna, I'm still gonna keep doing it. And I just love it, love it, love it. I got these to try and excitement isn't even the word. I, I, I just can't even. This is just a piece of fabric I have here. Um, you can use pillowcases, shirts. This is part of a piece of quilting fabric because I love to quilt. And I'm going to definitely be using these in my quilts coming up. But I love prayer flags. Prayer flags are one of my favorite things to make. So I thought, well, let me just play around with these for a minute. I'll throw the camera on. That's why I'm talking over it, um, over the video. And they give you these little sponges. You can get them to put on the stamp, the paint. Um, and then I just go place it in the middle. The problem that I had is has nothing to do with the product itself the problem is i didn't measure and you're gonna see what i did now these print like magic they print like you printed it out of a printer they are gorgeous you get all the nooks and crannies and the oh my gosh i don't even know how well you can see that but it is delish delicious so now i'm going in with um a feather stamp from plaid um, it's again in the uh, series for the fabric creations. It's a beautiful feather and I'm going to put it all around the middle part. However, you will see because, because I have problems with my left side lately of being numb and I can't turn my neck and whatnot. Um, when I go to put the one uh, feather, you know, the feather stamp on the one side, you'll see I go too close to the middle and it kind of screws up my uh you know, my thought process and the way that everything's flowing, but you know what? I don't care. I'm not somebody who is into perfection. I'm into having fun and doing something that I love to do. And let me just tell you, I am so in love with this, as you're going to see as I keep going. So anyway, I don't wash off my uh, little stampy uh, foam thing. I just kind of, I pat it off and I turn it. There's four sides to the sponge. So why not just, you know, work with one sponge. And I'm going to put that on and you're going to see I'm going to put it around the middle and it prints gorgeous as well. And like I said, a little, little too close to the middle on the one, but I keep rocking. I don't even care because I'm going to turn this into something beautiful when it's done. So I'm just going in and I give it a push. I don't even know how hard you have to push. Honestly, I'm very, I feel very weak today in my hands. Um, so you'll see me putting my whole hand on it. I don't, I'll have to test that to see how hard you have to. Uh, push it down but honestly I don't think that it's too hard now you can see they're a little too close it's all right I'm gonna keep rocking and I just I just like putting these just every which way and this color is gorgeous 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 I don't know if I told you the name of this color this color is lime so yeah so that's um hot pink was the first color and lime is the second color. And then the next color I'm gonna use is African Violet. And woo woo, wait till you see these, how nice these print. Ugh, the excitement, I can't even stand it. I can't even stand myself right now because I'm so excited playing with these and my mind's going a mile a minute. So I had to do this. I'm gonna upload a little this you know video up for you guys. Um, that's it right there, that is the African Violet. And, uh, and then I'm gonna make something. You know, I'll sit down with these and make, you know, another thing on here and show you how to measure it and kind of know what you're doing. Do you know what I'm saying? A little bit better. But like I said, you don't really even have to. Have fun. So um, I'm going to be making prayer flags. I'm going to be making quilts and I'm going to be making, I got all kinds of stuff planned for this stuff. Um, so yeah, so I'm just taking the African Violet and I'm opening up. That's a three pack of the stamps. And these stamps are my new favorite thing. 
Now, I will tell you this. I can't use them that well on um, a flat, uh, what's it called, canvas. Now, I might be able to put those black things under it to see if that gives me a little pushing for my cushion, cushion for my pushing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, look at these. Watch. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. No, is she doing another one? You know she is. Look at that. Look at that. Watch, watch, watch. Yes, yes. In love. In love. And I don't even stop with this color because I squished a little bit uh, out more than I needed. So I'm going in now with this pretty daisy. And I'm making that purple all the way around, you're going to see. And it's just delicious. It's delicious. It's easy. It's fun. My mind's going a mile a minute. I'm going to use this in mixed media in my quilting uh, just for the to make some prayer flags, all kinds of stuff. So keep your eye out because this is going to be coming. The, you're going to be seeing a lot of this on my channel. So I am so excited. I hope you guys are as excited as I am for this product. I've not seen this product before. So, you know... Uh, I'm just beyond like excited. I'm, I told you my mind's going to mile a minute. I'm just going to be sitting and writing stuff down. So, you know, I, I just love showing you guys stuff and I love using things in the normal way. And then of course, in our mixed media way. So, um, they also, you can also buy a brush, which I'm going to show in a second. And the brush, what it does is it cleans those stamps real good, gets in them little nooks and crannies. And um, oh, now I'm showing you, I'm left. what the heck was that? Did I even show you the middle? I tell you, you know when I get excited, I get crazy. Listen, as always, please be kind to each other. You never know what battle somebody else is fighting. You know, I love you guys so very much. And I hope this excites you like it excites me. There's the brush to clean it. Make sure that you clean the stamps good because it does get in the little cre the crevices. Share me like I'm your loose friend.